So in January of 2019, I went down to Phoenix and I ran the 24-hour across the years running race. Woo! We gotta go ring that bell. 100 miles. Woo! Woo! 100 mile beer. Woo! You know, in that final mile loop, I had a lot of opportunity to reflect. I reflected on how far I've come as a runner, but maybe more importantly, how far I've come as a human being. If you know me, you know that it's never about the run. For me, it's about the people. It's about the lessons. It's about the discipline to train and the grit to push through what you used to think was impossible. It's about relationships. It's about strengthening existing ones and creating new ones. I run for me and for no one else. So whether you are just running a 24 hour race, or just running a 5K, or just walking a block. Do it for you and for no one else. I think you'll be amazed at what can happen when you just show up. All right, and there we are today. We're talking to Mike Cameron. He's a Canadian writer, speaker, philanthropist, ultra marathoner, we'll get into that, an advocate against gender-based violence. Mike went from literally bagging shit, this is from, his, from your website, Mike, to founding, building, and running an award-winning multi-million dollar business uh, he's worked on a, a variety of nonprofits and charities to pave the way for violence-free future. Today, he designs programs to assist men and tap into their emotions in a real and authentic way using his emotional reconnection practice. His book, Becoming a Better Man, is available on Amazon, and we'll put the links up here so everybody can get it. Uh, if, if, if you're on YouTube, you got to check out his TEDx talk, The Way Men Think. Uh, of strong is wrong. Uh, I definitely urge everybody to take a look at that. I watched that. It's pretty uh, emotional, I think, and I got out a lot out of it. So welcome, Mike. Thanks, Ryan. I'm thrilled to be here, man. I appreciate it. 